Hey, Get Fox here. Today I review of James Conner, the new team of the week. Heroes, 91 overall halfback with 88 speed, 91 acceleration, 86 agility, 94 carrying, 69 catching, giggity, uh, 85 elusiveness with the plus three along with the plus three to carrying for the uh, zone run chem. I get that run block boost from my lineman. And him trucking 91, break tackle 78. All right, now James Conner. Better than John Connor, Sarah Connor, and any Connor you've known ever. Also better than Le'Veon Bell. Go ahead and at me, but it's it's true. You know in your heart. Uh, I think everybody's kind of wishing Le'Veon Bell doesn't come back this year. Uh, Steelers, NFL, like go ahead, release him at the end of the year. What do you guys think? That's what I'm hearing. Uh, we'll see if he shows up though uh, before this goes live in a couple minutes because I'm uploading and posting right away. Anyways, uh, the card itself, you guys can tell by the stats, it's not very good. Like. This car with 79 break tackle is a, is a disgrace. With with Ricky Williams uh, out there right now, the point of this card is it, it, no no other halfback is, is really needed. Um, he felt pretty sloppy on the stick. I didn't really like you see it's kind of I don't know I don't know how to describe it like other than like you know how I say like some backs are fluid like Christian McCaffrey was a little fluid, not not Connor. He wasn't that way at all. He didn't feel he felt a little like yeah like not perfectly responsive he wasn't a great avatar on the field for me so that's unfortunate um this this stat the stats in the car like 79 break tackle for for the way connor runs the way he's able to shed off defenders it's disrespectful i, I know team of the week and the way they upgrade cards is basically just giving plus ones twos threes fours or fives across the board and they don't really like specifically upgrade certain stats uh, very often especially for a team of the week where they really should try and do that but the way he goes down just so easily, you could tell the low break tackle is there. And with trucking backs, you really need a heavy, like a heavy dude if you want somebody with a lot of trucking to make it really work pretty well. And trucking and break tackle, I think, go pretty well together. Uh, but so, yeah, he's not going to fall forward for you too much. He's not going to really, um, I don't know, fight for you. He's not going to outrun defenders. He doesn't feel that, that agile or loose on the sticks where you can like really like make people uh, look silly with your with your moves. He's got the spin tier though. Spin and juke tier is great. Here I am wishing. See me in the lower right. Wishing, rut, yelling. Go, go James. Oh gosh. Thank you for getting there. That, that, that 88 speed is really, really makes you nervous there uh, when you are running. So otherwise, yeah, I, I, like, you know, obviously that spin is still, I think, a little too powerful. Um, but that's like the directional spin is fine. It's the spin that gets animations that I don't like that much because um, I've, I've seen those animations fake out users. So while we still have it this year, use it, I guess. Uh, the burst on him there. He got a little bit of a burst there to get that first down. So, I mean, he's not like, okay, he's not unusable. Right? But but for his price, the reason he's priced so high is because the ammo set. So like for his price, he's unusable. Um, but like if you want the ammo, so who's pretty good. Uh, go ahead and do that instead. So get him for a game, maybe try him out, then make the Amos if you want a strong safety. But to, to, to have this guy, because he's the set cost, because he's so high because of that set cost, I just I just don't see it. I don't, I don't think I don't think that's something you guys should do with your coins. Uh, unless you're a huge Connor fan, and then then go ahead and, and, and uh, giddy up, I guess. But I would prefer like waiting maybe another Connor down the road that's better properly statted, uh, more, more uh, I guess, better for the price as he fumbles. Shoot. So out of 10, gonna give him a four. Thanks for watching Call to Action, I'll see you tomorrow.